Hello Galaxy Heroes, apologies this video should have been out quite a few hours ago, however, um, as my daughter kept pointing out, I was falling asleep downstairs uh, after being fed after, uh, spoiler alert, unlocking Jedi Knight Luke. So, this is round one, um, you need a Relic 3 Womper or higher, my Womper's Relic 5. Thought, yeah, this would be easy. Uh, it's not easy. It's not. I mean, and this is the start of the bloody thing. Um, this is... Uh, this is another frustrating uh, challenge. Really, really frustrating. Be prepared if you haven't already started it. Oh, my days. It is frustrating. So we do the reverse of this. So then we take on the Wampa and your cloak i'm sorry luke um yeah and just working out which way around to do it or when to heal and when to ability block blah 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 eventually we get there um this video is broken into a, a few sections they're all linked well the, the, hopefully it should be seamless yay see so look that was uh first go um i couldn't do anything with this this is quite frustrating it's a case of uh yeah but this is the unit you've given me so this is on me isn't it if i can't make your unit work and you think it should that's down on me so perseverance let's just keep at it and uh, apparently we will do it so <clears throat> that's what we do I mean, not that he gets foresight, but I mean, Wampa hits through foresight anyway, so there's no real defense against Wampa other than attack. And you've just got to hit him harder than he hits you. Boom, thank you. On cue, wasn't it? So there's round two, round three. So uh, this is still fairly straightforward. So this is with Cold Han or Captain Han C3 uh, and. Chewy, uh, even this one, I think I was a bit perplexed. My Chewy is R7, um, Han, Cold Han is Relic 4, um, and then C3 and um, Rolo, um, Republic Officer, Leia Organa, or whatever, Rolo, um, is also relic three but she does have her zeta uh as does in fact they all have their zetas if there's a zeta they can have they've got it so then this is round one it's like what round one round two so um fortunately i didn't quite understand this one about there's a timer apparently and you've got to stop fader from coming out and uh, i wasn't aware of that this goes back to my advice of do it before everyone tells you it's difficult and it's not as difficult as everyone tells you, if that makes sense. Yeah, it's like the, you've got to see this movie or TV show, it's brilliant, and you watch and you're like, really? Yeah. <clears throat> um, so we're getting there. In fact, I, I didn't even try to attempt to hit Vader. Um Apparently, as I say, he's on a timer and you got to get him before he does. We did. Yay. So, moving on again. Uh, so, that's that. On to the ships. Okay, so a few goes at this one as well. Um, so, I've already covered the Han is Relic 7. Sorry, Chewie is Relic 7. As is my Han. So, my Millennium Falcon uh, has two Relic 7 crew members and my wedge is also relic not as high he's relic three so i'm playing it and not quite understanding what the game wants me to do but i'm trying not to hit like retribution ships until han's ready to go because he debuffs them or takes away their buffs not so much puts a debuff but clears whatever so I'm kind of like, I'm getting there. I'm wondering what this uh, strange hyperdrive symbol is. Obviously, I now know it's a hyperdrive. So wedge sods off. Uh, 
um, off you go as well. So you jump to hyperspace and then boom, I lose my falcon. Yay, wonderful. Um, so we have another go at that. I think we had a few goes at this. In fact, I do believe what yeah yeah um quite a few of these uh required more than one attempt um the main one is coming up and uh, um it was one that i just did not enjoy being honest i didn't enjoy it i was getting very frustrated especially when i was seeing other players that were managing to do it you know after i started and it's like what's going on here what is going on i don't understand so yeah lose again <coughs> so uh, i think by now i'm starting to grasp the concept i'm reading through the blurb again just getting some insight and hoping that I can understand what the devs have said I need to do is what I'm doing. Um, sometimes I don't quite uh, follow or understand instructions as they're given. Um, yeah, it's just, yeah, it's just me. In fact, it's probably not just me, but um, yeah, sometimes I do struggle with written instructions. Yeah, and that's when it's kind of like, please, somebody, someone, please, for the love of God, explain to me what it is I am meant to be doing here. So I'm getting a bit anxious again because my uh, my wedge once again is looking exceptionally fragile. In fact, so is that Y wing as well. So um, we're getting very close. Yeah, that is a loss. Yay! Let's go again. Excuse me. I can't see in the lead up. The, the frames are running along underneath and I can't quite see far enough in advance to know whether I can say, yay, it's finally coming to an end. So this time around, I used yeah. You know, wedge went against uh, Vader's ship to start with, just to avoid the, the retribution from that Tie Fighter that's come in. So, oh, we're close, but now wedge sods off, yay! And then. Go on, you jump into hyperdrive, so that leaves three, and then, oh, three, that leaves Han, and then that comes up, and we don't jump into hyperdrive, but somehow it's a victory. Yay, go us, go team. So, that was me just double-checking that I'm still recording, and I am. Um, I think I have a confession. I think I've actually missed one of these stages. Thought I was recording. You know, there you go. Even when you're testing and making sure, or testing, you're checking and you're making sure, you're still not always guaranteed that you're going to get the record. But uh, let's get rid of you. So this is round one of two. Hermit is... Uh, I took Hermit to Relic 3 because that was the requirement. My Hermit has only ever been Relic 1. Um, it's basically... <laughs> You don't really need him any higher. I don't think he brings anything more by being higher relics. I could be wrong, and if I am, please correct me on that. Uh, but, yeah. And York is, I think, is gear 9 still. Uh, only single Zeta. This one's double zeta although there's only two of them, which means that the second Zeta is completely useless in this one. So, oh uh, yeah, so this is one where he goes in and the, he's in the caves and so therefore it's like, it's what he takes with him. And uh, yeah, can he, can he do the Vader? Can he? Can he? Of course he can. Yay! This one wasn't too bad at all. Moves us on to tier four. Tier four where... 
Um, I believe this is the one that I called the, uh, the piggyback mode. Because on this one, this is where C3, there's, only, there's four tunes, but one of them is strapped to the back of Chewy. Um, yeah. Oh, this one I really, really suffered with. Really suffered with. This is the one that I just could not understand what I was doing wrong to prevent you know me from actually completing this because this really just ah oh. uh, I'm sure there is a really good strat somewhere out there and if there is my advice would be follow it um I tried so so many times to get this and this was kind of like the outcome that I was facing time and time again I'm down to one tune and gone one tune and gone, one tune and gone. Um, in fact, I've got quite a few vids just sitting on the scrap heap at the moment where um, I've lost one of the tunes in round one. And it's like, nah, I can't go against. Because that boba is just through the roof. Oh, what are they? They're saying they're level 85, but they're gear 14 or whatever. Relic 7 or I don't know. I do not know, but again, you can see, look, Chewie's almost down, and this is still round one. Uh, Chewie is down. I tried this one just with Leia and Han. Oh, no, I don't. I tried this one with just Leia and Lando, and um, yeah, it's kind of... Yeah... I must admit, I was querying like the my sanity. What was it I, Einstein says something along the lines of his sanity is doing the same thing over and over and expecting a different result. Well, you know, that's all we can do with this. Sorry, I'm just getting a bit more comfy, but that is all we can do with this is just you know keep going unless you want to start feeding in the old raising the relic levels. In fact, I think I did. I think I took. Lando to Relic 4. He was Relic 3. Um, I think I did take him to Relic 4 just to see. And um, I, I think I also need to move the mods around because I ended up putting a speed set. I changed it from a crit damage, crit chance on Rolo to a speed set with a, a potency cross um, just to see whether she could land her bits better so we've gotten down to three of them and now there's one of them and now there's none of us yay um so we go again um this one again is gonna end in tears and of course you can't skip all the intro so uh yeah for me, it was getting a bit, okay, I've watched this animation, I don't know how many times. I probably did this one, uh, maybe 20 times or something, I don't know. I did this one a stupid number of times. I'm even checking Boba to see what's going on. Look, we've got ability block on him this time. Uh, let's do the AOE and... Lando down, uh, Chewie down, and you know, if that's the case, you know where you're going, and uh, it's going to tell me that I can upgrade all my tunes and spend loads more money. Yeah, no, 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 no. You gave us the <laughs> you gave us the requirements for this. If those are the requirements, then normally the rule is is that you can get away with less than the requirements, not having to beef them up even more after your requirements to enter this event. Go on. So um all right, so again, if you look, Chewie's health is virtually non-existent, which means as soon as he gets hit, he's gone. Forever the optimist, you try, you try, and then uh, you try, you try, you try, you die. And we're gone again. So, here we go. 
this one I believe is the correct one. So, ability block on one of them, or two of them I think to start with. So Leia's got that ability block as a basic, let's just do the AOE. So we need to chip them down, we need to get through all of this additional defence they've got before additional protection actually, isn't it? Another AOE. Go on, Han, Lando even. Mr. Mustachio, there we go. Let's go back to what his name really is. Oh, look, uh, we've lost Rolo. So even on the successful one, I was unsuccessful to begin with, if that makes sense. Right, so they do all their beep, 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 bleep, 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 bleep. Yay. And now we're... So we've got ability block on all three of the stormtroopers, which is handy. It means that they're not initially taunting. And I'm going to try and get ability block on all of them again. Unsuccessfully, there we go. So now we have one taunter. Uh, but we do now have the ability block on all three again. There's an AoE. I'm going to clear that debuff on Chewie and he gets one back immediately. The AoE here takes out First Order Officer. <clears throat> Lando with a nice big hit. Let's do a cleanse on Chewie again. We'll do another AoE just because we need to get them gone as soon as we can. To stand any chance of getting through with some health and protection, possibly, for the second round. And this awful, or great, whichever way you want to view it, Boba. Because he just does us time and time again. So I'm ability blocking Boba, I don't know why. Because he does that, and then Lando's gone. But I do still have my Chewie at the moment. Still have Chewy. Where are we going here? Oh, we're going to do the AoE. So, we managed to get Boba down. So, Boba now can't revive, but now we've got this taunt going, and we're down to Leia and the Stormtrooper. And finally, finally, CC Peniston. Google it if you don't know, get what my drift is there. But finally, we're there. So I do believe, uh, so that's tier 6 or tier 7. So again, going into this, uh, mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. And um, we go through all this animation and... Um, yeah, at least it shows that I didn't watch anyone else. Because, <laughs> again, I was doing the old Einstein thing of just repeating everything. Can we get him? Can we get him? Can we get him? No, of course not. Does his saber toss and wig on? So, again, have to go through all the animations um i believe that's going to be my screenshot for it if you're wondering what that was there hopefully you should recognize it because it is the screenshot i liked and i'll put it as the thumbnail for this vid don't know how long this vid will take to upload because even it speeded up it still took a very long time a very very long time so round through round one, yay! Now Vader's going to start throwing shite at us. Um, I'll elect. I'll take the hits and then just try and reheal and get through all of this. Didn't realise, of course, initially doing all of this, that the buggers come back again. Look, there they are. Don't ignore them. They're a bit tricky to, to lock on to. Um, but yeah, let them go or deflect them or whatever and then try and stay alive. Yay. 
Another saber toss puts Luke down. It is cool. It is cool. That is some of the... I can't fault the graphics. The graphics on this, the animation and everything was wonderful. Um, My issues were just with kind of like the interactions and it wasn't easy. Although I'm sure everyone would be up in arms. If it was easy, you know, we've got to do it. Um, You know, it's meant to be a challenge. And a challenge kind of by its definition should exert you, should test you. So um, this definitely, definitely tests one's resolve. Definitely. These are all the YouTube notifications coming through telling me that everyone else has got it and I'm the only one that hasn't got a Jedi Knight look. I know that I'm not the only one that doesn't have, but, you know, that's kind of where you get to with it. Oh, hang on, am I ignoring? Yeah, there you go. That's what happens if you ignore those things, so you need them gone as well. So, yay, lucky us. We get through to go through this animation again. pauses for a dramatic sip of tea so yeah i'm getting tired doing the commentary on this one uh nowhere near as much as piggyback c3po oh my god that one for me was just that was just awful um so just you know if no one else has told you then you heard it here it's awful it really is be prepared um you know clear quite a few hours in your schedule to give yourself the chance I mean, hopefully you do that and you clear it as a breeze on your first attempt and you think what the hell was he on about yay if that's the case then fair play to you you deserve it um me i don't know maybe i just went into kind of cocky or whatever it expected to just breeze through and um yeah it's not a breeze through it's not a breeze through it is definitely a test of which i can attest it's a test so i'm just playing with words there why not so we've got through the first round of the flying shite um, we've got through a ta- sabre toss. We're going to work our way through and start whittling Vader down. Oh, look, all the flyy shite is back. Let's not ignore the flyy shite, even though it does take a while to get to. Uh, we're getting him, we're getting him, we're getting him. Oh, the flying shite is back again. Please don't ignore it. I didn't ignore it. Go on, go on, go on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. So we're almost full strength. We almost got him down. And then I'm like, what? But then it's like, yay, because actually you know, being thrown through the window is a victory. Um, I'm not sure the message that's in there. <laughs> uh, I'm just joshing. Um, so, yeah, I think I've missed one. Uh, I believe this is... The last one, this is where we have Vader. My Vader is Relic 5 and has both Zetas. Yes, my Vader has the Zetas. Um, Anyone that's known me for any period of time will know that my... uh, I think my... That is such a cool animation. My my Vader uh, didn't have any Zetas for the longest, longest time. I just, um, yeah, I, I, uh, there was always a tune that needed it more than he did as far as I was concerned. But there we go. There we go. I do believe that's what we needed to do. There are the final 60 shards which enable us to complete tier 7 done. Activate, and this is just the final kind of glossy bits. And even this isn't glossy because I didn't quite have enough pieces. I did say it was a long vid, sorry. I'm drinking way too much here to lubricate the vocal cords to get through this. So bing, 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 ding. Jedi Knight Luke Skywalker unlocked. Level 85. And I think I get him up to... 
there's a lot of faffing around now with me just trying to upgrade his gear um, as much as possible. Uh, I, I didn't have the resources to be able to get him straight to Relic, um, which was frustrating, but understandable at the same time because what I also had to do was I had to get Lando, Mr. Mustachio, up to a Relic, Rolo up to a Relic, um, and then stupidly started relicking Clone Wars Chewbacca until it dawned on me that they're saying legendary Chewbacca. So, yeah, so I spend some crystals here on some stun gun pieces um, just to enable me to get him a, a, a higher gear level. You know, it's the... Uh, it's the thing, isn't it? Normally, the new shinies are good, and you want to be able to get them up and running as quickly as possible. And then you find that you've burnt through all your resources, or you, yeah, and then you end up doing stupid shite like this, uh, uh, as I did. So, uh, I believe. This is probably where we are going to leave everything because I don't have the pieces to complete him. So we're just going to go through the abilities and just click on those. In fact, I think I end up signing this off without even putting any mods on him. Uh, mods wise, he does have some mods now. Uh, mod wise, I've gone with offense with some crit chance. So an offense of uh, the uh, the offense that is a four piece. So he's got the four offense mods and two crit chance mods now. Um, I'll do some gameplay with him if I can use him somewhere. Unfortunately, he doesn't qualify for this round of GAC. Um, could be interested in, in could be interesting in GAC. We'll see. We'll see where he goes. Um, ability wise, so far I've done he I've done everything except his lead. His lead, uh, I don't have enough Zeta mats, but I've slapped him in my Ray team at the moment, so I did his unique Zeta instead of his lead Zeta. Um, yeah, we'll come back to that as, as and when. But I did want to share with everyone that I do have Jedi Knight Luke. He was painful for me to do. I will be talking to my therapist about that and I am going to thank you all for watching. You all take care.